name is Terry Dobson. I'm the musical director for our upcoming production of Lost in the Stars with a book by Maxwell Anderson and a glorious score by Kurt Weill. Over the years here at Theatre 3 I've done, I have worked on three Kurt Weill productions. Uh, the first thing that we did was his most famous piece, The Three Penny Opera, um, which had the famous uh, song Mac the Knife and Jack, uh, and I put together a review, actually, of Kurt Vile's songs, which starred six women, and we called it Vile Women, and that was a wonderful, wonderful uh, experience here at Theatre 3. And then uh, the the third production that we did was actually a special event. It was a um, gala fundraiser uh, that the board threw, and we did a sort of concert version of uh, his 1940s piece, uh, Lady in the Dark, which starred Danny Kaye and Gertrude Lawrence, I believe. Very ahead of his time, uh, both in musical writing and in material that he chose to musicalize and um, you know and at the time I'm sure people just thought oh he's so far out there you know so avant-garde um, which makes his works now when you hear them almost you know like they were very fresh like written you know now so um, um, just musically and um, Theatrically, he was a sort of a trailblazer, I think, that, that set the, the bar for people like Stephen Sondheim and Leonard Bernstein and, um, you know, some of the, our, you know, contemporary composers now. Lost in the Stars was written, it, it was actually the final Broadway show that he wrote, that Kurt Weill wrote. And, of course, back in the um, 40s, they seemed to have had unlimited budgets for um, casts. And so he's written the show with a cast of 26, plus a singing ensemble of 30, and a dancing ensemble of 30. You know, our typical show size is like 10, 12, you know, something like that, maybe 15 people. So this one has 27 people. So the sound is really gorgeous, but I, I guess the biggest challenge was just um, creating that big choral sound uh, with actually a smaller ensemble than it was originally written for. The big message that from the story that I think audiences will take away from our production is the idea of uh, forgiveness and friendship, um, but I hope they also see in our particular production um, lots of new faces, a uh, lot of uh, friends who performed with us before, um, and just the, the glory of Kurt Weill's music. I, I, I hope people will leave the theater and say that was a fabulous production.